here we are perfectly on time again and oh my god my throat is not feeling great today you guys i don't know what happened yesterday i guess i was yelling at the panel over the weekend it could be a delayed effect from that i'm convinced it was just the horribly polluted la air combined with all the extra smoke from the fireworks last night but hey there everybody hope Hope all my American viewers had a lovely 4th of July. Hope all my non-American viewers had a lovely 4th of July. <laughs> I guess you still call it that no matter no matter where you are. But hey there, Golden Pen. Hey there, Minoyo. Hey there, Masungus. Aduna Duna. Ginger Lion 32. Jonathan Jostra. We have Reuniclus X, who, by the way, is the only... Out of... Out of anyone uh, I met at Anime Expo on Sunday, was the only user from this entire channel who identified himself. So I've now met Reuniclus X live in person uh, over at <laughs> over at Waifu Wars Three, and Reuniclus might also be able to identify that I have I'm, I'm wearing the neat girl the neat girl date night T-shirt that I received. As a gift from my fellow co-judge Hitsuji, creator of Neat Girl Date Night, uh, <laughs> where's my signature purple hat? I did wear I did wear the purple hat, but no, today we're doing a blue and black hat. I wore my signature purple hat to the panel, of course. Oh, and uh, RPG Nat, thank you for resubscribing for four months. Yeah, I had the blonde. Yes, yeah, see, Reuniclus could say I had the I had the purple hat. And the Bond Clay shirt, like I always said I would. Uh, Dylan, thank you for the gifted sub to Reuniclus. That's very sweet of you. Uh, Tomar, how was your hentai panel? I wouldn't call it a, a hentai panel, Snot. It was it was 18 plus, but hent I mean, and we were giving away hentai games as most of the prizes. Oh, that's right. I got a big J list gift card as a thank you. Uh, for for doing the judging, I what 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 am I what am I gonna get from J List? They have stuff that isn't it, like sex toys, right? Anyway, <laughs> this is not a hentai stream. Uh, anyway, drawing blood. Hey there, I hope you're doing well too. Jonathan Joster's here. Uh, just a lot bear, Sergeant Flipper. I'm not gonna have. I'm not gonna super project my voice today. And we might even, I don't know, we might even cut it short just to try and preserve my my apparatus. I need to, I have more stuff I have to record tomorrow. I had auditions I had to do this morning. Uh, it's just one of those times. Berserk, Berserkiva 2, Berserkiva 2. Hello to you, hello the Dude Man 147 both first time chatters. Uh, Tomar, buy booba mouse pads. Oh yeah, that's just what I want to fill my house with when I'm about to have a baby snot. That makes a lot of sense. Let me, let me fill my house with porn stuff. Uh, what's Zach like in real life? Asked Bubakin16. I mean, he's like he he's a lot like he is in on Oni Place. He's uh he makes me laugh a lot. <laughs> uh, he's just he's funny. He's funny. He's he's uh he's a smart guy. Uh, I, I, there's, I, there's really not a lot that you're missing. Uh, loud exploit. Uh, thank you for the hundred bits. It's not a hentai stream, but thank you anyway. Arby's gaming with the dime and the happy birthday as always. A dime and a happy birthday to you too. Uh, Tomar, what's your favorite hentai? We promise we won't tell anyone. Uh, I'm not going to get roped into this. Protect the iconic Tomar voice. Uh, Golden pen H yeah, I gotta, I gotta. Maya's first toy should be a booba mouse. That's a terrible idea. B Bart's chatting. Says my first live stream with Tomar. Greetings from Germany. Thank you for tr tropping in, Barshatten. Barshatten. Is that is that a more? I'm not gonna pronounce it like a real German. I'm not a real German. Uh, the low, the low cal, the low cal calzone. Thank you. We have a new subscriber, the Low Cal Calzone. I'm still gonna play my Jew harp. All right, that's for Low Cal Calzone, and then Nine Piece Magoober. Thank you for the hundred bits. 
How was Waifu Wars? I was at AX Sunday, but I couldn't make it. Oh, also happy birthday. I had a ton of fun. I was just saying, I, I got this cool... I got a bunch of cool swag that I will show off throughout the next few Tomar streams. I got... You know what? There's some stuff I want to show off right now. I got specifically the one thing I... Because the, the, the fellow Bradley, uh, who, who spa, who's been hosting this event now for the last three years that being 2018 2019 then mm -hmm. skip the pandemic and this one that just happened uh he he works with nexon and he so he got us a, a bunch of cool aside from the j list stuff also got us some cool nexon swag so i got this maple story jacket i gotta show you guys i'm gonna be right back with a maple story jacket so you guys know you know it's worth it you know it's worth it uh I'll be right back. All right, you guys, I'm, I wanted to come in and model this. I don't have a whole lot of space. But here, let's, so I got my Neat Girl Date Night t-shirt from Hitsuji, my fellow judge. And here I've got my, can you guys hear me okay? Let me move the mic up a little. And then I've got this lovely branded Maple Story jacket. Look at that. Can I, yeah. No, it looks, I think it looks nice. Here, let me zip it up. It's like a Letterman jacket or something. I don't know. I could, I could do some like, uh, some, some Epo style training in this jacket. But, uh, oh, the back. What's on the back? You tell me. We got this big, I can't see it, but I think it's a big Maple Story logo. You'd think I would have looked at it before I put it on, but no. <laughs> uh, but it's too fucking hot to keep wearing this thing. Yeah, this is a big, yeah, it's got this, oh, it's got, oh, it's got a sick. That is awesome, isn't that? That maple, that maple leaf. No, that's, that's a great jacket. So I'm very grateful to Bradley from Waifu Wars for that. And for all the other cool stuff he tossed at me. It was a really fun night at Waifu Wars at AX. I, I do not regret going. Now, okay, let's move this back down. <laughs> back below the top of the green screen. But yeah. Yeah, representing, representing Canada inadvertently with my cool maple leaf jacket. This one goes out to Canada. This one goes out to all those Canadians in the audience. Let me <laughs> Tomar, will you play Weed Shop 3? I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. Hey there, Broken Mojo. Hope you're having a good night or day. I can't remember what part of the world you're in. More like Maple. No, no. You, you wouldn't say that. I can't smell. No, Nuggie. <laughs> Ayo. I knew you'd come around. I, I'm... It's a it's a misconception that I hate Canadians. I just hate Canada. <laughs> no, I don't. No, uh, I'm totally cool with uh, with Canadian things. I just don't think Cana I My biggest issue with Canada to this day is it's poor. It's poor uh, media export quality. Uh, you know, and you know what I mean. I'm not talking about like low export quality from Adobe Premiere. I'm talking about I'm talking about the sh the shows that they produce, but but that's not the same as disliking Canadians. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Johnny Test. That's 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 on the list. It's on the list of things that Canada should regret. Um, <laughs> I didn't just say it's poor. I said it's poor media exports. You're putting words in my mouth for Uh 
Total Drama Island's in that in that list too. Uh, <laughs> let's see. <laughs> I never said it's poor. Did my did my audio clip out? Uh, all right, you guys can take your little sound bite or whatever. Oh, Vern Thrax, thank you for resubscribing for thirteen months. I got it. I just want to talk really seductively into the microphone so I can avoid projecting at all. Is that all right with you guys? We're just going to talk like this for the rest of the night to save my voice. I'm not going to whisper because that's just as harsh, but this is the simplest, this is the simplest way I can talk. Simplest or, or I don't know. You know what I mean. It's the least amount of vocal effort is to just talk like this. So we got Vern Thrax. Thank you so much for 13 whole months. And thank you to Mousebox. Mousebox. Thank you. Thank you, Vern Thrax and Mousebox, for both subscribing for 13 years in a row. Vern Thrax simply says, yo. And, uh... And Mousebox says, it's the best day of the week, everyone. Every happy Tomart Tuesday. And hey, it's 8-11. We're pretty close to it being Tomart Tuesday time. You know what I'm not going to forget this time is to throw on this silly leather-bound top hat. I don't know why I said leather-bound. It's just leather. But <laughs> leather-bound, you know, when people talk about, like, fancy books... This leather bound, like that, that's what they used to do to sell like Encyclopedia Britannica on TV. They tell you like, this beautiful leather bound collection can be of yours for only, for only 12 payments of seventy nine ninety five or something. It's, it'd be something ridiculous like that. Uh, has anyone here seen the 16 voting PSA? I don't think I have full metal 18. Uh, I've seen the Jello Apocalypse voting PSA uh, <laughs> for what that's worth. Um, oh, Daily Grind Seven. We have a new subscriber by the name of Daily Grind Seven. That's nah, too hard to say. Seven. Daily Grind Seven. Uh, and then Azuma. Azuma has been now been a subscriber for twelve months. An entire year of Ozma. Tomar, the volume of ads you run for the Canadians who can't afford a sub, can't afford to sub is kind of horrid. Are you saying I'm talking nice and, and softly and then the ads, by contrast, are extremely loud? I'm sorry to hear that. I'll see what I can do. I'll talk to, I'll talk to my people at Twitch. I don't have any people at Twitch. I'm sorry. I don't know what to do. Uh, but... <laughs> Uh, I'll, I'll do what I can. It's always Tomart Tuesday, like 50% of these streams. Well, that's exactly right, Broken Mojo. We only stream twice a week. That's the beauty of it. All right. Now that it's, uh, I mean, it's 8.13. That's almost 8.15. I'm going to start loading up, loading up our Tomart Tuesday UI. I should just buy Tomart.com, but now that I said that, someone else is gonna... No, you know what? I bet someone already owns Tomart.com because their name is Tom. And they're like, I'm Tom and I do art. No, I'm just some jackass who went on HugeDomains.com and decided to camp on this on this domain that nobody wants to pay $4,000 for. Yeah, never mind. Apparently, it goes to huge domains, but the forwarder doesn't even work. Imagine that. How do I... How do you... No, I, now I want to know if Tomart.com is owned. I need to... Hold on, you guys. This is important. Tomart.com. Obviously not available directly. You could own Tom.art for a mere $10,000. $10,764. That's great. Yeah, tomart.net.org.info. They're all owned. They're all owned. We could buy tomart.dog. We could buy tomart.club. Tomart.biz. Tomart.house. Tom, tomart. Tomcraft.info. I see. Even this assumes that I'm saying tomart. Tomart.opia. That's a good one. If only opia was actually a. 
uh, <laughs> a thing. Uh, but uh, there probably is an IA though. What is Tomar to Tomar Tope IA? Is that a thing? Doesn't exist. Unavailable. The ending dot IA does not exist. I assume dot Pia does not exist either. There's no cool Tom. Now, now we're talking Tomartopia though. That's just silly. Um, all right. Well, there's no way to obtain Tomart.com that I'm aware of. Uh, so we're we're just gonna be done with that whole thread of brain. Yeah, that's right. Um, <clears throat> I might be a little under with the weather today. Uh, but the stream goes on. I really, I really don't like to cancel unless I'm totally unable to make it. Uh, all right. Oh, just raised 16 K Sis Sis Ranis. However, I'm supposed to say that six six Semper six Semper Tyrannus. Oh, it's like a, like a language. It's like Greek or something or Latin. I don't know. Anyway. Is pro is Semper is Latin, right? Or is it Greek? Oh, I don't. Anyway, thus always to tyrants. It's Latin. Thank you, thank you, Six Semper Tyrannus. Anyway, Six Semper Tyrannus is uh is is, is saying that if we had sixteen thousand dollars and could afford to pay it every year, we could own our own TLD. I believe that's what what you're trying to say. I don't think that would be worth it just to own tomartope.ia, but <laughs> but it is it's a thought or tomart.opia. Am I bald? Asked Bubikin sixteen. You tell me. <laughs> um, no. What have I done? All right. The hat goes back on. We're gonna, gonna close all my other windows, save some dang memory, open my main Tomar profile on Chrome or whatever. We'll go to twitter.com. You know what? I have a, I, I finally made a bookmark to Tomart so I wouldn't have to keep typing this in every time. Oh my goodness, we're seeing some interesting stuff right off the bat here. I'm going to scroll down, scroll down, scroll down. June 28th, we've seen all the stuff from June 28th. But here we go. The Tomart starts. We're going to lead with an FKIM presentation. Let me just get my share set up real quick. Okay, and bam. All right, Baso Yotha. What? What? Say say that to make Mexicans kids cry. It's hilarious. Ba well, that sounds like it's probably a bad thing to say. I'm gonna not repeat that. Uh, <laughs> I don't I don't know Spanish too well. Um, so this one is by F Kim. It's got Tomar on the left there, and he's saying. Here I can move I can move my my jar out of the way in case anybody's having trouble reading that. It says this is my first case and the first witness is him and then it's clearly it's the trumpet fight guy uh with with Ronald McDonald makeup. I like that. This and then, <laughs> and of course there's a kind of rushed and late post for uh Tomar everybody keeps Talking about that clown. Thank you for just saying clown and not saying uh, in Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney. So I decided to draw one only on Tomart. Thank you for that, F. Kim. Your contributions are always so appreciated. And I'm not being sarcastic. I'm just trying to keep the energy at a at a level, you know? Trying to keep my voice from getting worse between today and tomorrow. Uh, just a little scratchy. My throat's been uh, full of not so great stuff since I woke up this morning. Uh, Tomungus. This one is by 
drawing blood. It's a lovely little Tomungus. Maybe not the first Tomungus I've seen, but but certainly one of my favorites. It's still got so much personality, unlike any actual Among Us character. Uh, I, I don't think that this is that a burn. I I, I burned a, a game that made some random people like into like multimillionaires. I think they'll be fine. Uh, so very very cool artwork there with the emerald and the the the, the backstabby knife thing. Thank you for that drawing blood. Tomar <laughs> is pretty freaking sus. Says drawing blood. Oh boy. Here we've got some tome art, which appears to have come from Mid Journey or some such bot. Mid Journey attempts to generate Tomar in both his regular and eldritch form. Let's see. So that that just looks like that's it's like me with like a pur purple bike helmet. It's not really me at all, but let's use our imaginations. It's me with a purple bike helmet and uh and like some and like a purple upper lip for some reason and it looks like i've got like a glass pipe with a little emerald shaped bowl at the end and it's just sort of abstractly the green is 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 like reflecting off the pipe into my beard or something i don't know and those beautiful hazel eyes which i really do have Look into my beautiful hazel eyes. No, don't do that. Uh, and then let's let's have a look at this. Is an assortment that is very eldritch horror esque. Yeah, look at this guy. It's just a guy with a beard and like a. It's it's some combination of of a, of a baseball cap on the bottom, but it turns into like a bandana on the top, and. This hair looks like my beard hair, but then sort of resembles like a tree line. I really, there is something so cool about the, the unintentional abstractions that these things do where like, yeah, this looks just like the beard hair, but then it looks like a tree line with like a cool, like, like waxing moon or whatever, waning moon going on up there. And then I'm just shrouded in this, this cloak. I don't know what else to call that. What is this painting AI called? Uh, I think it's Mid Journey. I, I, unless this person really has access to like Dolly Three, but my my biggest guess is that this is that this is done by Mid Journey bot. Uh, which is which actually its main thing. It's accessible as a Discord bot right now if you're able to get in. Oh wait, a zone made AI bot pictures of me in their last stream. I'm actually I one of the people that shared uh mid journey access with Zone. So I guess he's paying me back. He or she, they. Uh they're making a Dolly three already. Uh is that really true? What are you talking about, Reuniclus? I've heard Dolly Two still does certain things like way, way better than mid journey, but I I have never gotten access. This next one, those were all just done by Weeping Blade, by the way. Our very own Weeping Blade here. This next one is by Derp Chaos. We have Tomart Anime Expo 2022. Pretty accurate portrayal. They got my T-shirt right, and that's that's the most important thing. The cat ears and the paw print. I I don't even own a hat like that. I will. I would never admit to it if I did, but no, I I don't. And I didn't wear that. I just wore my normal purple hat. Uh, also, uh, that really does happen when I when I wink. Little stars and hearts come out. That's why I never wink on stream. I don't want to freak you guys out. Uh, why is Zach's voice so weird? But Bubikins, listen, Bubbla. Zach's voice is Zach's voice. I love Zach's voice. I don't know why you got to be like that. I don't know why you got to call people weird. That's not very nice. Uh, Super Tomar RPG uh, by Jack Cheese J. This this is a lovely one. This is like I'm thinking this is like a Tomar Gino. Um, is that supposed to be like a Gino? I don't know what to. This is just a cool image. I like this one, Jack, if you're there in the in the room. 
There's I I like the big the big beard follicles kind of based on like the 3D model version of me. That's pretty cool. Uh <laughs> Oh, you saw my QR code to Chris Monkey Martian. I mean, I know he was just trolling with the whole we're 80% through all the QR codes because it's like QR codes are just a way of encoding data, dude. But I'm like, I think he knows that and I'm going to look stupid if I try to correct him. <laughs> oh, and uh, oh, by the way, uh, I, I missed some stuff. F Kim, thank you for resubscribing for eight months, nine minutes ago. Eight months sub, says F Kim. Tomar, when you're going to invite Zach so he can teach us some tech lessons... I hate that you guys keep implying that Zach is more technically capable than me. I understand that that's why you keep doing it. But 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 how long can this dance go on? This dance of danger. Hey there, first time chatter. Ikieri, uh, who says simply, whoa, it's Tomar. This is Tomar. We're in full Tomar energy mode trying to preserve the Tomar voice. Uh, just for anyone who's just joining us and is wondering why I'm so so unusually calm this probably isn't that out of this isn't even slightly out of character for me i guess um <clears throat> let's see and then uh yes yeah, so thank you for that jack cheese j that's a lovely that's a lovely rendering and then <laughs> i saw this final last minute one from f kim made it in this is just <laughs> that's amazing that that looks like it was really drawn for the show. Uh, did did you do that? You, I mean, I would I would one hundred percent believe that you did, F Kim. But like he he's like some perfect little amalgamation of like the Desmond style, and like all the things that would make Chris Chang Chris Chang. Yeah, I knew you did, F Kim. I knew you did. It looks perfect. Tomar is CWC. <laughs> Zach Hadel's amazing backflip. <laughs> I love this. I, lo I love these. Tom Tomomoto is going to voice the iconic Chris Chan and Smiling Friends. Uh <laughs> oh, you do such good work, F. Kim. I love this. It's pure brilliance. I found some leak on YouTube about Tomar's next character on Smiling Friends Season 2, and there's preview only on Tomar. This is so perfect. Thank you for that, F. Kim. Uh, ooh. Uh. So that's that's it for our Tomart Tuesday. We can put the jar back. I was starting to miss the jar. But we're going to get rid of this. Okay. So I recall uh, a stream or two ago, Azuma was kind enough to um what did he, he well he, he he set up a form for you guys by the way thank you dylan for the gift sub to planet piss 69 <laughs> enjoy that planet piss 69 which i got to say twice now boogery bungus thank you for subscribing for 11 months now that's i'm so appreciated that you've stuck with us this long all right, Tomar, let's get real. Me or Snot? Which one of us, some like it Snot, I should say. Which one of us has the mucus that makes you pucus? <laughs> the booger, boogery, boogery bungus or some like it Snot? You guys, do we need to have like a, a, a muke off? A muke off? That's what it would be called, right? One who, one who is mucus is muking. Is that right? Is that the verb of being mucus? <laughs> this is disgusting. This is broken mojo. There's going to be a muke off, but it's going to happen off camera. It's going to happen off stream. Uh, and it's going to be arranged entirely by boogery and snot. So I don't have to do any work. And they're going to tell me who won uh, next week or by Thursday. And I'm going to announce the winner. <laughs> so that's the end. That's the end of that discussion. <laughs> Uh, all right. So, so yeah, some people, uh, submitted some cringe things. Uh, and I thought we'd just like have a little fun since, 
I feel like a lot of people really enjoyed the other day. Like, you know, and I can take this off. I'm taking this off. I thought we had fun the other day watching those. Um... Oh, they're doing them. They're doing the muke off in the poll, I guess. If anybody cares about that. Um, so, <laughs> of course, somebody cares about it. Just not me. Just not me. Uh, <laughs> let's um, let's go to uh. <laughs> to, to, to some of our submissions. I guess I could have just kept that capture window up. I don't know why. All right. So let's see who submitted what. Uh, Ozma arranged these nicely for me. Video night submissions. So this first one, what do you guys think? Hilarious. This this video it was submitted by um actually I don't know who submitted these because that's not how they're listed here. All I know is uh the video is called Hilarious Fight Over Stolen Bong. And uh the reason they gave for me wanting to watch it was because yeah, this these were apparently the submission field fields where it's two dumb dudes fighting and saying the funniest shit to each other. Tomar probably hasn't seen this. That's true. Uh, what should... So, so Tyler, Ozma, do, can you guys tell me... Okay, so we didn't take names on the form. Can you guys tell me, should I play this one? Do you think this will risk us violating some kind of like violence law? Or, or not law, you know what I mean, a policy... I, I guess I have plausible deniability. I doubt it. I doubt it. No. Uh, Dylan is saying probably don't. It probably doesn't violate it or probably shouldn't play it. I don't know. Look, we're just going to watch a quick video, okay? It'll be great. This one again. This is a five-minute video. Wow. Wow. No, I'm excited. Let's uh, let's get our window capture back. Here we go. These are the guys. Hilarious fight over stolen bong. Uh, I reserve the right to stop this at any time. These are just some guys. They're just doing a thing. Presumably. This doesn't feel like a real fight. This doesn't feel like... Two people in a life or death situation. I don't consider this legitimate violence. Yeah, they're taking big swings. Maybe they're just that bad at fighting. It feels like they're... <laughs> There's just a lot of big haymakers uh, missing. I hope they didn't say any really bad words there. Bro, you stole my ball. I, I, Yo, I know for a fact John sent me the pictures and said it came from you. This has got to be like some kid's home video. Don't lie to my face, bitch. That's why I wanted to fight you. I wouldn't be mad if you told me. I, like, am I supposed to, like, is part of this being cringe that I believe that they're really having this fight over a bong? Or, 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 or is the cringe that they're trying to get me to believe that they're really having a fight over a bong and clearly just swinging at air? Yeah, he he's giving him little taps on his head. I don't know. Actually, no. Okay, it's starting to get. It's starting to seem like it's getting a little personal. I don't know. That's no. There's no malice in those knees. This is just getting dopey. They're. Oh my goodness. Yeah, rips his shirt off. This aims for his like n like lower neck for some reason. Just watch. Just watch. Just watch. This just goes on too long. <laughs>
This guy... There's no way. This is not a real fight. This is just silly. But I guess if it were a real fight, I'd want to watch it even less. Because we'd be probably violating some kind of rule. That's enough of this. I'm not cringing. Let's see what else. So this next one someone sent is Foam Adventure, which I've totally seen. And this is a 10 minute long video, so we might scrub a bit depending on how it goes. But this one is a classic. This, <laughs> I've 100% so seen this video and I've even seen they did a follow-up video uh, like like a few years <laughs> back like where I thought they were gonna like rag on themselves <laughs> but they mm. they didn't they they just seemed to like be like oh we were funny weren't we <laughs> there you go hide it behind your bag <laughs> Yes. They'll never know. <laughs> 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 ha ha ha. Oh yes. Sexy. <laughs> Sexy, you guys. Remember when everyone typed like that? No one ever spoke like that, but remember when everyone typed like that in like 2000, you know, three? This is from 2009, by the way. Um, <laughs> Roar to Smexe. They, and they added all the subtitles themselves. That's that's uh, clear. Right now, as it is. <laughs> I'm really enjoying this. So am I. They're getting their foam. They're so excited for this foam. This woman's doing an excellent job, though. She's patiently measuring out the foam. Where would this be? Is this like a Hobby Lobby or like a, uh, like a Michaels? Nine and three quarters. Wow. How much was it? Nine and three quarters. Yards. <laughs> thank you, Tutty Wuddy. Oh yeah, and thank you. Oh, I missed a few here. Dalexis uh, 866, sale? thank you yeah, for <laughs> resubscribing for eight months now. What on earth did I just walk into? Oh, you walked into Cringe Night. Cringe Night on Tomar stream. And uh, Shrimps 247, 13 months, 13 whole months. 13 months is still our current max. I think that's how long we've been streaming. Thank you. Now, this is epic. Exactly, Shrimps. And then uh, Tutty Wuddy has resubscribed for 11 months. Oh, Tomar, can we do scary games at some point? Oh, we'll do scary games, Tutty Wuddy. We'll definitely do st scary games throughout October, but... I, I feel like I owe it to some people and myself to finally go back and finish Yuppie Psycho, which, whether you consider it a scary game or not, I think it's a scary game. I think it's... I, I love games that are scary with with yeah, just like five. pixel graphics and there are a fair amount that are I just really yeah. I'm I find Yuppie Psycho very charming Vincent Dodd says this is scary enough Re. you get chat I think we got foam Should we? That you yeah, that they're they're they've taken to harassing everybody with an open window. They they really are in their own little world, their little foam world, their nerf world where nothing will hurt them, and there will be no consequences for their actions and the way they conduct themselves around other people. They've never faced- these are people who have never faced consequences. <laughs> Hattie Flat says, this is kind of sweet, actually. You know what? It's totally innocent. 
but again, something I want to point out about cringe is that the things that make us cringe the hardest are are one are things that we can see a little piece of ourself in there. Maybe maybe it's a younger version of ourself than the person posting their cringe. Uh, but at some point in our life, we would have thought that there was some merit in doing something similar to what these people are doing. Uh, <laughs> and it just goes on and on like this. They're really excited about the foam. That's the gist of this. I think we've watched enough foam in <laughs> adventures. Uh, yeah, exactly. Behind all good cringe is someone who tried. I do believe in that Bartleby Lumpkin. Uh, Tomart, why is the steering wheel on the wrong side? What's wrong with you, peep? We invented the automobile, Tyler. Americans invented the automobile, and Henry Ford invented the mass-produced automobile. We put it on the correct side, and then everybody else who drives on the left side of the road did it wrong. That's what I have to say. You're saying it was a German guy, but, but was it a German guy in Germany, or was it a German guy in America? Tell me that. A lot of a lot of awesome things were invented by German guys who were like who made it out of Germany before like the Nazi party rose to power. <laughs> uh so how about that? Anyway, I'm taking Americans were the first people driving in large quantities thanks to Henry Ford regardless of who invented the automobile. So it's a French guy, okay, but was he? did he invent it in France? Or did he invent it in the United States of America? That's what's important. Again, driving totally an American, brought to the common man by Amer an American named Henry Ford. That's all that matters here. <laughs> it's a Flemish guy who made it in China, says Zafter. <laughs> Let's see. We know France is an important tomar, so it's not. Ford was a dunce. Okay, Uncle Chris TTV, if you say so. Har Harrison Ford made the first car, actually. Tomar, this is going to be a cringe video. No, I'm just... I just wanted to put Tyler in his place for complaining about the side of the road we drove drive on, because we were definitely driving on freeways and and road and and roads and stuff before the british who reversed everything and then all the other europeans and the australians who copied them uh the car was invented by a british military officer his name was general motors <laughs> thank you for that harold Krell. i have no idea who truly invented the car i have no idea uh anyway <laughs> let's uh, let's, let's go to the next video before I ramble on some more. Tomar, please censor bitch. Okay. That's for you, Arby's Gaming. Fred Flintstone invented the car in 1947,000 BC. 1947,000. <laughs> anyway, uh... They're called freeways, not T-ways. <laughs> the British, the British people. Okay, <laughs> let's stop this. Let's stop this horrible, this horrible thing that we've started, that I've started. Uh, gr this one's called Granny. G okay, so that one was called, the, the, the reasoning behind that one was their love of foam. This one's called Granny Goes Crazy. It says, the poor quality, the twist of the storyline, and the amazing acting. I feel like this is going to be someone's innocent, like, home video they made with their grandma. Joe, I want to go swimming at 5 o'clock in the morning. And you crazy old woman. You think one minute I'm going to get up. These people actually are charming. And go swimming. Joanne, I think it would be a good idea. No, I'm not getting up 5 o'clock in the morning to go swimming. 
Joe, I can't understand why you don't want to go early in the morning at five. The water would be so cold and nice. That's it. I'm signing you up, Ma. What are you signing me up for? I'm signing you up, good welfare woman. First, you're going to have to catch me. Go. <laughs> you're a welfare woman. I'm not going to no welfare. No, Grandma, no! <laughs> that, I love that. That was amazing. It's the best video we've watched all night. Angry Grandpa, every fart ever. No, I'm gonna skip that. <laughs> that's, that's not what, that's just the autoplay video. Uh. First you gotta catch me. Uh. Okay, yeah, no, that was the whole video. Uh, <laughs> this next one is called Root. Oh, this is called Chris Chan being racist at an Indian restaurant. Oh, goodness. I've seen this one. This one is incredibly difficult to watch. Uh, but let's. Oh, Arby's Gaming submitted this one, apparently. The reason given was. It's incredibly difficult to watch, plus it's Chris Chan. Okay. Should... We'll just watch a little bit of this. Mm, it smells good in here. I mean, it's, it's only 22 cold. seconds. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty empty. Oh boy, I'm gonna... Okay, now I just, I just feel like I have to do this first time in here. I feel like I gotta do this. Hello, my name is Apu. I went to... No, 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 and he had to finish the thought. And he had to finish. The... <laughs> imagine you can. Everybody can okay, imagine what it would be like. Maker. Jesus, <laughs> I'm sick of these auto plays. Can we turn off auto play? Oh yeah, we can. Uh, okay, that was like being stabbed, quick and painful. Puzzled ferret one says. Uh, <laughs> That is real cringe. It, just imagine being taking like like a like a new friend somewhere, and they're just like, "All right, I just got to do this," and you you like, "Wait, what?" <laughs> oh, oh no, that that is classic. I'm glad we watched that. <laughs> Don't ever do that. Let this be a lesson to you. Uh, to, oh, I don't know. But this is the po the poo poo song. This is like something for children. Oh, I guess I'll click on this one. This was submitted. Who who submitted the poo poo song? I, I I'm not. This is gonna be uncomfortable. I'm sure. <laughs> this is enough. I get the idea. I get the idea. I'm glad this isn't like a. You must sit and watch this challenge. Oh my god. Uh, this, oh wait, what's this one called? I've been told my this, I've been told my laugh is very reminiscent of the Joker. Oh, this seems like it's going to be a good one. Uh, don't worry, you're losing watchers. That's not true. That's not true. Uh, okay. I've been told my laugh is very reminiscent of the Joker and whoever recommended this said, uh, the coworker trying to fake laugh. I see. All right. Well, let's 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 give this a listen. But that my laugh is very reminiscent of the Joker. Of the Joker, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I hear it. I think, yeah. <laughs> Keeps doing it. Are you laughing? Cause I am. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. That was that was something. All right. Let's let's try this next one. Uh. What do we got? Um. 
Let's watch Kingdom Hearts Final Mix, Sora vs. Roxas live action. Good IRL roleplay cringe with really good editing. Okay, this one has really good editing, you guys. So I've Ew. been told. Sora. Roxas. She was tiring. She's part of the darkness now. She doesn't need the light. You're a nobody. You're a nobody. <laughs> well, that's actually a thing in Kingdom Hearts, isn't it? <laughs> What do they have? Umbrellas? Where are your friends now? Oh, they have like amp guard foam weapons. Oh, that's even worse. I wish they had umbrellas. But he says you're nobody again. Oh no! You're you're over, Sora. Kind of messed up there. Their plan is like, uh, it's <laughs> that just deteriorated at the end. I thought he'd do something cool with his dual wield. I can't kill you, you're part of me. You're a fool, Sora. Your fool, Sora. Walks away with cool giant Jinko jeans. <laughs> that was perfect. All right, you guys. That was. I think that was. I think that was a good one. I didn't cringe too hard. That was just kind of fun. But it was cringe. Uh, let's see. The shock value. Duck this one. I don't. I don't know what this is, but the person who proposed who who sent duck this one is proposing it's cringe because of the shock value. What are we getting ourselves into here? Duck this one. That's not. That's not cringe. It's not cringe. That's just like a video. Well, that didn't belong here. Who submitted that? Who submitted that? The cringe was that you thought that that belonged here. Uh, all right. This one is called Tutorial on Grime Step. I don't know what Grime Step is, but we're about to learn together. Hey, how's it going? This is a tutorial on how to grime stat. First thing you need to do is you need to make a Mayan wobble sound. And what the Mayan wobble sound is, is this. And then you need to make a blap sound, which is B-L-A-P. Okay, so you got and you got okay, so B L A P, and just uh, when you do it, you're kind of making that Mayan wobble sound, but at the same time, you're I don't, I don't have anything to say sound, about like this, blap, like a blap, 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 blap. okay. Which is kind of like a deep baseline hi hat in a way. I don't, I don't, I don't uh, feel like thing, I'm watching cringe. Um, You're asking me to do what he's doing, is, Tyler. Uh, I'm not gonna do that. Let's see here, the haw sound. Okay. I'm just, I'm here to watch like you guys. Which is the machine gun laugh. Okay, so it's ha 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 ha. Ah ah. So you got. You get it? That's okay. a good. yeah. I, that, that's enough. We're almost, we're over halfway through the video. I, I, uh, 
uh, to someone to someone very specific maybe that's cringe i don't get it it's like when i'm on like a lot of shared cringe feels this way where it's like it, it's it's like when i feel like it's like 14 year olds cringing it's at 10 year olds What is this video it's called? called road, it's called the Rainbow Road. This is someone's cover of the Rainbow Road theme. When you get there, it's called a road, it's called a Rainbow Road. It is a road that you go. That you go. It's a road that you go when you die. When you die, okay. It's a road called Rainbow Road. It's a road we're all gonna go. It's a road. I hope this guy's road. improvising. It's a road called Rainbow Road. It's a road we're all gonna go. We'll go. Yeah, it's like I would forgive this if it was improvised. It's Rainbow Road. It's where you go. I don't think it is. When you die, it's Rainbow Road. Maybe this was improvised and his friends were like, that's freaking hilarious, dude. You need to make that into a video. This is his audition for Tim and Eric. I'd believe that, Harold Krell. There, this is like, yeah, this has like a not Tim and Eric. Did anybody ever go to our not Tim and Eric? It has like that kind of quality. More than like it being a real cringe video. There's something charming about it. In that not Tim and Eric way. In loving memory of Uncle Walter. Yeah, no, they're 100% trying to do like a Tim and Eric thing. I don't know. That's that's maybe too self-aware. Uh, but nice try. Nice try. <laughs> uh, here we go. How about this one? Rex came in. I was... Uh, what? This is called Twisty P goes for a walk and greets fellow citizens with great respect. Came in, I was still in his tonka. Rex came in, they could fit in his tonka. Rex came in, but I'm still in his tonka. Seven mil on the table, and I'm still saying tonka. What? Look, look, hey, look, hey. Look, hey, look, hey, look, hey. I'm running there, working there, booting there. I'm on the side of the beer, smack them. Why say that bitch doesn't love me? Is this did this guy do just just take some? This is this is drunk or drug addled behavior. I hear your music, turn it off. That's just so I turn me a meal. And he's slurring all his words. He's running around barefoot, kicking puddles. And yeah, whatever he's yeah, maybe he thinks that we can hear what's in his headphones. I'm gonna exit did he I'm say, uh, I don't know. I don't even want to try and guess at what he's saying. <laughs> That's DJ spit. Everybody It's it's IRL DJ spit. <laughs> Get out of my head, man. All right. Uh, this next one is the last one we have. We're going to have to up our cringe submission games. You guys game, you guys, if we're going to do another one of these, uh, Man, there's some stuff I really wish I could play for you, but it's lost to the internet, and uh, I've taken a solemn vow not to reintroduce fully deleted cringe to the internet. <laughs> I want to show Max's grand adventure so bad. This is uh, Ben Sidran, Cool Paradise, Walking with the Blues. But what is what what? Okay, Jazz, and there's Lisa Simpson. By the way, uh, I missed some stuff. Uh, I think Drawing Blood 22 minutes ago, resubscribed for 11 months. Thank you, thank you for that, and sorry for missing it. Next month will be a year of Tomar. This is just background. You know what, I'm worried that there's some sort of copyright claim ability to this thing. But uh, it's, it's, yeah, I mean, it's a mess of a video. But I don't think I'm I'm feeling cringe there. Uh, but post post better cringe chat. I mean I appreciate everyone that submitted, but I mean maybe the the lesson here is that cringe is not as universal as we think. But try to try to aim for the more universal cringe. 
Oh, Ozma sent me some more uh not Tim and Eric. Let's I'll take that. Oh yeah, I wanted to get through some stuff real quick before we watch Ding Ding. I, I don't think I've seen this video though. Uh Drawing Blood said, Can I expect let's see. Next month will be year of Tomar. Can I expect maybe a special dinner at a certain Italian themed chain restaurant for our first Tomar anniversary? How do you feel about unlimited breadsticks? All right. We're taking Drawing Blood to the Olive Garden for our one-year anniversary. <laughs> uh, Java, Java Moss Boss, thank you for subscribing for six months and earning your third Tomar Emerald. Uncle Chris TTV. Uncle, or is it Uncle Christ T? Uncle Christ TTV. There's there's three T's there. Uh, thank you for the 31 bits. Jay Hin Lol, thank you. We have a new subscriber, Jay Hin Lol, or... Jin Lol, I'm not sure how to pronounce that, but thank you so much. Uh, Estes Soup, thank you for resubscribing for a whole year, earning your fifth Tomar Emerald. A whole year of Tomars is Estes Soup. This will surely have no negative consequences on my young, impressionable mind. No, certainly not. Uh, all right, let's watch Ding Ding. This is this isn't meant to be cringe so much as not Tim and Eric. Oh. If you are a girl and you see a pretty boy, let it go, ding, ding. If you are a girl and you see a pretty girl, let it go, ding, ding. If you want love, five fingers in a glove, hold hands, ding, 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 ding. Oh, oh I don't like the tongue. Oh, ding, ding. The tongue move he keeps doing. Oh. But I do again believe that something like this is self-aware. Hi, welcome. And now, interview. Which is fine. It's better that it's self-aware. Boy, girl, boy, girl, boy, girl, girl, boy, boy, ding, ding. Girl, boy, girl, boy, boy, girl, boy, girl, girl, ding, ding. Boy, girl, boy, girl, boy, girl, 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 ding, ding. Tomar scrubbing to see how much more ding, ding is left. That's enough ding ding. But <laughs> we get the idea. I'm gonna I'm gonna dig into my I'm gonna see what I've got in my collection to see if we can if we can salvage this cr very cringy night. Uh but I do appreciate everyone who submitted, even if I hated your video, even if I thought it was completely inappropriate for cringe. I appreciate the participation. I did not like Ding Ding Ozma, I'm sorry. Uh, but here, let, now let me, let me peer into my archives and let's see what we've got. Let's see, we gotta go it's like, I, I wish I could show you guys the file system, but it's, it's probably for the best not to. Like, I'm going to look for this stuff, and then I'm going to try and find it on YouTube to prove that it's out there and I didn't reintroduce it. Does anybody remember? Oh, this is a classic. Let's see. I'm going to try and find this one on YouTube. Oh, yeah, here's here's some genuine cringe. Kind of inappropriate. So I'm just going to go <laughs> This this one this this one is real cringe. Uh let me get my capture back. Okay. Has anyone ever seen this one? It's called Eat Their Ass. Uh, here we go. Ask the ladies behind you if you can eat their ass. Hello. They're British. Can you stop? Oh, they understand? I, I they understand. Oh, my God. You guys are too loud. I have to leave. Oh. They're embarrassing me. Wait, you're leaving? 
I'm not, I'm not done drinking. They speak English, right? Well, they're British. I didn't know. Wait, don't leave. <laughs> She's leaving. <laughs> the palpable cringe happening in that room. Yeah, those are real people. <laughs> I don't know what country they were in. But he's like, can you ask those ladies behind me if they could eat your ass? <laughs> no, they were not actors. Uh, that's a fun one. All right, I'm going to go. But that ah, that's such a short one, too. Let's see what else we can find. I still have the original Elmo and Grouchland review. Uh, I need to find if someone's reposted anywhere. Though. <laughs> I feel like he did his best to scrub that off the internet. Elmo and Grouchland review Mike Matei. Oh yeah, it's still out there. <laughs> There's a super cut of it. You know what? That's probably... Let's not watch that. Mike Mike himself re-uploaded. Oh yeah, it's on Cinemask or Clips. I guess that's their official thing. Well, that's no fun. Where's the holiday ham though, Tomar? Do you really want me to... I'll, do you want me to replay the ham video? Do I have any other... Any other film wave stuff here? Grenade prank, holiday ham prank. Uh, we had the he we had like the. Do you ever do the heaven or hell pranks? Hold on. I need to find these. Let's see. F -f 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 Looking for film wave. Devil baby, we saw the exorcism gone wrong. Did we ever do the heaven prank? Let me see if I can find this one on YouTube. Film wave heaven prank. Yeah, this was re uploaded. Okay, good. This is a good four minute one. Here we go. Hurts, it tingles, it's burning. It's like shooting. It's like going, shooting up my arm and it's like going into my chest right here too. My chest feels tight. I don't know, maybe these pills will help. Maybe these pills will help. I wonder what the hell it is. This is how this is how any classic prank starts off. The guy standing alone talking to himself, taking pills. <laughs> maybe these pills will help. so bright oh. Oh. I love his acting what the hell? second Where to am none I? I can't see anything the light's just blinding me hello what who's that this is God oh God you're in heaven what I died Yes. Oh my god, my arm. I was having a heart attack. I'm dead. Oh my, is it true, God? Am I dead? Yes, you are dead. Oh my god, I can't believe I died. This is great dialogue. <laughs> I was only 40 years old. What about my kids? How many? I don't have any kids, but what if I had kids? What about them? Did he just say 40 something years? 40? What about my wife? Anyway. I don't have a wife, but what about her if I got married one day? Don't worry. In heaven, you can eat all the food and be with all the women that you want. Oh, thank you, God. You're such a good God. I'm sorry I never believed in you. I was always a Satanist. What? I mean, I went to church regularly, and I and I did all the things that I wasn't. I I I was supposed. I didn't. Never had premarital sex. Well, I never even had sex, but I didn't have any sex stuff, and I never went to any of those bad websites. I promise. Come towards the light. 
Okay, it's really bright. I'm gonna... God, I'm gonna come towards you, okay? Oh, I feel so peaceful. Oh. oh Stop! So... Oh, by the way... What is it? One more thing. Thank you, Lord what? Smokey Jeff, for recent oh, so traffic for five months. Oh, I can't, I can't believe that dying feels, feels so good. He's still oh, holding his I heart attack so arm. Much. Oh, <laughs> yes. Gotcha. What? What are you, what are you talking about? God? God, what? 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 what are you talking God, about, dead. God? Is your roommate. I'm in the other room. I got a speaker in here. I'm talking to you over it. I mean, you're not God. The payoff, yes. No. Can you turn Got the him. I'm Pranked really, my him. Eyes are kind of, they're starting to go. Okay, fine. Oh, my it's God. It's amazing. <laughs> yeah, I was never in heaven. I was always... I was never in heaven? In apartment? I was just in my unfurnished yep. apartment with nothing on the walls? And you were pretending Wait, to be what? God? Yes. What are my arm, though? It was tingling. I, I thought I was having a heart attack. How do you explain that, though? I don't know. Get it checked out. You're probably going to die. <laughs> I'm probably going to go to hell. <laughs> Say goodbye to my kids. I mean, when I have kids. You cheated on your wife. No, no. I am the devil, and you will fill my wrath. You gotta check. We gotta check out the hell prank now. <laughs> There's just something really special about those, you know. <laughs> Top tier prank stuff. You never went to any of those bad websites. Uh, my kids. Uh, if I ever, I mean, if I ever have them. Uh, uh, I need to save him. No, he'll be good. Wait, what else? Do, do we have... I don't even know if we have the hell prank. I don't think we ever found the hell prank. Well, let's... Actually, you know what? I'm going to look up film wave hell prank. Nope. That one never got re-uploaded. That one might be lost forever. If anybody ever finds the film wave hell prank, please let me know. Who will I prank next? Asked Pars Flower. <laughs> uh, Tomar, I think these videos might be those negative consequences I was talking about earlier. Drawing blood. Are you requesting that I... Here, let's see. Film wave. Ham prank. Oh, you know, the one that's on here is only eight minutes long. Oh no, <laughs> there's just clips of it. Oh no, here we go. Okay, so he's with a That's the robbery prank. I may have inadvertently brought back the uh, the ham prank from the grave. So I can't find a re-upload of it, whoops. Looks like you just have to look back at the, at the Tomar VOD. Uh, submit, submit cringe says nightbot submit cringe please please submit your cringe oh lyle says he has the hell prank saved well, we got to see that fine since we've already ruined it and played the the played the ham prank let me see we'll play it one more time the classic the classic ham prank but I gotta change. Okay, everybody. I gotta change my capture device real quick. Cause this one I'm playing a locally. Holiday ham prank dot mp4. home any second, and he just went to the store to buy a ham for Easter. When he gets home, I have a little plan for his ham. All right, I hear him coming. All right, here we go. The roommate places his ham on the countertop and walks back, presumably, toward the entrance to his apartment. 
Then the alpha roommate. I'm going to call them. This is the alpha roommate. The other guy is the beta roommate. Just random names. Just random Greek letters. No meaning there. The alpha roommate takes the ham. Beta roommate realizing his ham is gone. I put it right here. You can see the utter shock in his face. What, what's going on? He places his hand on his head. He can't believe what's happened. God. This is the live commentary version. So now full of... What's going on? Full of dismay. My ham Not knowing is what gone. to do about it's his missing. missing ham. He confronts his roommate to explain what has happened. It was right here. Did you take it? Alpha roommate I says... See a ham. He's like, never I mean, seen the ham. ham. He's clearly lying. Outside. He's, well, he's how long ago was this? He's per 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 he's I don't know, 10 committing the ago? ultimate act of betrayal against his, his roommate now. Beta. I don't know. Oh my God. Beta roommate now hits rock closer. bottom here. He's convinced he'll never now? he'll never see his ham again. He has no idea how how he could possibly fix wow. his well, I, Easter I see your ham. without that ham. He spent Oh wait, are you talking about the ham that was right here? And then there's a glimmer of hope. And hope is quickly oh, replaced by anger. It's a joke. It's frustration at his joke. friend's I'll, I'll betrayal. I, I got it. What? It's, it's a, a joke. joke. And then finally, it's a joke. Finally, he reveals the prank. Yeah. It was a prank all along. The ham was in fact it's just off camera. Ham. Just off camera. Sorry, I. I, I and as he settles into the it's new reality yes, in which his ham is safe joke. and sound, just don't hurt me. It dawns on him he hates well, cooking ham. You cook it, cause I. And I hate cooking hams anyway. So and forces roommate Alpha fine. to prepare the ham for them both that they might enjoy One an more Easter thing. together. Don't eat any of it. Well, not together, it turns okay, out. Okay, Roommate's going to be home. <laughs> right. uh, just some of the most compelling theater I've ever seen. I have some stuff to go back and acknowledge. Uh... Thank you, Arby's Gaming, for the 15 bits. The real fringe cringe was the friends we made along the way. Uh, 176, thank you for the dollar tip. Try reacting to Wendy's Pretzel Bacon Pub Burger by Food Dip. Really? Is that... Okay, I'll do that for you, 176, for your $1 tip. Tomar, <laughs> watch some Henry's Kitchen. Uh, we'll see. But thank you for subscribing for five months. Just, I was honestly, just the idea of a pretzel bacon pub burger is that, that just sounds good. <laughs> Zore Kodo, thank you for the 500 bits. Uh, Oatmeal Boat 12, thank you for resubscribing for seven months. No, eight months now. Thank you, Oatmeal Boat. Oh, Tyler, thank you for the gifted sub to Orao Rats. Uh, Hassan Pepperoni, thank you for the 100 bits. And we have another new subscriber, Arrow Angel. Arrow Angel. Thank you. Thank you for subscribing and joining us here on the Tomar stream. I'm not ignoring 176. Well, I did ignore him for what? 12 minutes. But you know what? That's what keeps 170 strith, 170 strith, 176th virile and strong. A little ignoring. Monster gift! Thank you, Zore Kodo, for the Mama Monster gift. And thank you to ter ter Terolix for resubscribing for six months, earning your third Tomar Emerald. What up? Stay handsome, King, says Terolix. Thank you. I will. I'll do my best. Uh, yeah, what is this? This isn't going to be cringe, so I'm going to make this quick. But I, want, I, I will look up, in honor of 176th, I will look up this... Uh, Wendy's pretzel bacon pub burger by Food Dip. Yeah, man. This is a 13 minute video. I am not watching this whole thing. That's for certain. Okay. So I'm here with my main man. What's your name at? Big Pop. Yeah, okay. And the one in the back. Sorry, I'm catching your face, bro. I didn't mean to. I'm sorry for that. But, uh,. Hey, maybe you can get famous, right? right? So, I went to Wendy's, and yeah, I gotta comb my hair. Yo, you gotta brush with you, man. I gotta comb my hair. Is this just an I'm actual product they did? They made a pub burger? A lot of way weirdos around here. I know. I shouldn't ask you to come in either. 
Yeah. She wanna be the boss man. Carjack. She wanna be the boss man. Mm. And she's not a boss. You're the boss for the car. What, what it looks like it's just these guys talking for 13 you. minutes. All right. I, this vid is a goofy one. LS Mark in the back. <laughs> I, I don't think that looks quite like LS Mark. That's right. Just some guy. What he said. The food is good. That was a loud sound outside just now. It sounded like someone hitting someone else's car. And probably right about now, they're backing up and planning to drive away without ever reporting it. Welcome to Los Angeles. All right. I think here, yeah, let's see. Can we do... Oh, and thank you, Tyler, for the 10 bits. New batch of cringe in the sub channel. Hopefully chat makes them good this time. All right, here we go. We're going to try some more cringe that was submitted just here today. Oh, wow. We got a lot of submissions. Epic fat guy burp. Okay. Let's see epic fat guy burp. This is a nice 30 second one. Look at him, he's got the he's got like the alfalfa hair thing, or maybe that's supposed to look like a mohawk. He's chugging the whole soda. Come on, man. This better be epic. I'm expecting epic. Uh, uh, <laughs> it, was, it was just like, <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> it was long, but it was like, he didn't even try to project it. <laughs> it was terrible. Uh, I can do that. Uh, do you think he really did just couldn't just like dropped it and faked that sound? Anyway, Ghost Ghoul GX, thank you for resubscribing for four months. I hope to see my family again. Please show mercy, Tomar. We'll just keep subscribing, Ghostly Ghoul, and we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> I appreciate you subscribing. And of course, there are really I have no 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 families trapped in my home. The only family that lives here are uh, my family, me and my wife, and our soon-to-be daughter, uh, Java Moss Boss. Thank you for the hundred bits for the. <laughs> and they say best burp. All right. Yeah, sure. Says it long. No one, no one will ever believe me. Uh, this next one is called for Jr's eyes only. Wait. Oh, is this another Chris Chan video? Let's see. Hopefully this isn't, as long as this isn't too long, I'm open to it. It's five minutes. Hey Jackie, it's me, Christian. I'm doing this video for you. Got to upload to We'll see how far player. we can get into Hopefully, this. Hopefully, uh, trolls will not get that to there. I mean, yeah, I have not tried Media Fire for it before. But yeah, I do have a friend that recommends it as well, so for you, I'll try it. Uh, first half of the uh, video, though. Uh, what kind yeah, of video is this going to be? For, uh, Have I seen this before? Yeah, that thing. I for even leading you to the quick key. I just want to let you know about. Uh, is this the what one where, to me before where he describes I'm him the about drawing that. he sent but, to that girl? And then with that uh, reading, what you read on Ivy's page. Yeah, I was wrong. I forgot one detail of that. That detail. Yeah, it was uh, supposed. Yeah, yeah, it I was. was uh, to, yeah. Uh, uh, this Vanessa this Hudgens. This sounds like what anyone like would sound like me, when they're bad at lying. Well, online, and I had I held in with my self restraint as best as I could for a long time. This is the tongue video. And then she's kind of talked me into it a little bit. Ignore that. <sighs> Yeah, that's my cell phone. Oh, just one of my. I just have a cellular telephone, and yeah, you know, I just have one of those, just anyway, like a real uh, grown up. Yeah, I did make a video apologizing to Ivy for that. At least you know I can man up and admit when I made such a mistake. I did yeah. have a Mountain Dew shirt for many and years. That was in the past, and I'm sorry. I did not mean to. I did not mean to lie to you. I swear. I I just forgot that one detail. Anyway, as for that, uh, the quote-unquote Vanessa Hudgens, actually, uh, this 
was actually in reality this uh, Spanish dude I know, Joshua Martinez. Yeah, just he was he was just basically it was he was pretending to be Vanessa that whole time. And uh, he ticks me off, that guy. Uh, nurse nurse that's a nurse joy for another day though. Mm. Anyway with that suicide, uh I, I'm gonna show. I'm gonna show you some ways on how I can pleasure you. Oh, okay. I, yeah, I got a few ideas. Like you know, I would definitely give you some finger play. Not the finger. But yeah, I'll just. Yeah, I could be like. No. No. Ah, you lick your pretty little click there. Tickle your pussy. Ah, uh, this is not good. This is not good for Twitch. <laughs> We're done. We're done. We're done. We're done. But thank you for your submission. Uh, this one is called Me Singing. They should have... Me Singing Should Have Said No by Taylor Swift. I mean, it's a cover. I have a feeling what kind of cringe this is going to be. Strange to think the songs we used to sing, the smiles, the flowers, everything is gone. Oh, the poor dear. Oh, the poor dear. Yes, We're not gonna watch. We're not gonna watch Maybe minutes of this. She's just trying to sing. Oh, the poor wrong. thing. Okay. Of dreams and sometimes nightmares. It's a. Oh, this one is called "How to Make Ice Tea the Creepy Way" with Steve Sutton. Uh, oh, and thank you. We missed some stuff. Uh, Jello Lard, thank you. We have a new subscriber, Jello Lard, and Titling Polecat. Do not, do not underestimate Titling Polecat's resilience. He is seven. Titling Polecat is seven months strong. I, I'm assuming he, but that's not good to assume, right? Uh, I don't know what gender Titling Polecat is. Uh, love you, <laughs> love you, Tommy says Titling Polecat. Uh, how to make. Ice-tea. Iced tea. That magical elixir of dreams and sometimes nightmares. It's a common drink throughout most places in the United States. I like this guy. Yet it remains a mystery in others. He's relaxing the hell out of me. Some people have asked me how I make my iced tea. And I hope this video will demonstrate. Doesn't this guy put I you guys at ease? <laughs> even though the process differs from person to person. I mean, not him as a Enjoy. person, but his voice. <laughs> First, take a small pot and fill it three quarters of the way full with water. Next, place the pot on the stove and heat it on high until the water comes to a boil. While you're waiting, get four or five small tea bags and remove their cardboard tags. Removing the tags will keep the tea from tasting like cardboard. I also do that when I make cold brewed iced tea. I take all the cardboard off. All the little dangly things. When the things. water gets warm, place the tea bags into the water. See and what stir he needs to understand to is this is not the best them. way to make iced tea. I'm telling you guys, you got a cold brew. You got a cold brew your tea. Just put it in a in a cold then pitcher a and let it sit overnight, and you will have the best tasting cup of sugar iced tea. It. It's way less bitter than if you boil the tea. Cup. So it takes two scoops from it. You can pour it over ice or just serve it cold. I'm a big fan of cold brewing iced tea. Oh! Oh! He's never washed that. He's never washed that scoop. There's like 20 year old sugar crusted on that Hamster. thing.
Why? You don't need all that sugar. Just have to do some nice cold brewed iced tea. It won't be that bitter, so you won't need the sugar, and then it'll be healthier. Turn down the heat a bit to keep what is it going on? Out of the pot. Why but are you? That's not even a pot. Really that's well. a. That's a pan. That's a, maybe a saucepan, but why wouldn't you use a kettle? No. While it's boiling, you can tend to other things like the dishes. <laughs> Is this self-aware? Maybe this is self-aware. That's so bizarre. Or you can just watch the local wildlife. There's got to be some After self-awareness to this. Minutes, turn off the burner Thank you, Puzzled Ferret One, for resubscribing for two months. Yeah, this ASMR is putting me into a fever dream. Says Puzzled Ferret. This is ASMR. Make no mistake, it's just creepy then ASMR. Pour the water in the pot into the tea pitcher, keeping the tea bags in the pot to throw away later. And stir. And now you've just made hot tea with too much sugar. Which you'll then pour over ice. Great. Great, great, great. Congratulations. You've just made a pitcher of sweet tea. Now put some ice. Two cups of ice sugar in there. Yeah, exactly, Tyler. It. There's two cups of sugar in that pitcher. And drink. Good, isn't it? <laughs> you're like he's you he's got to be trying to creep you out though right enjoy your tea i wouldn't call any of that cringe but i i enjoyed the video i couldn't stop i couldn't look away oh okay uh let's go we're going down the list thank you by the way to everyone who submitted on such short notice uh this is this is just somebody who gave Matt Mercer's animation voiceover demo reel. That's not legitimate. <laughs> uh, grown man, Tom Green, gets lost in store and has to call his mommy. You know what? Tom Green makes some good cringe. Let's, let's have a look. Even if his stuff is self-aware. Please be calm. Please be calm. Please be calm. Tasty, tasty, tasty corn. Mmm, tasty corn. Tasty, tasty. What's that? No, I don't want you doing that on my PA. Oh, no. Not allowed to do that, or? No. How come you're not allowed? You're not allowed. How come? Because you're not allowed. You're not allowed to do that. But if you want to do it, just pick up the phone, hit the button that says page. Mom? Mom? Where are you, Mom? Mom? I'm lost. Mom? Mom, I'm lost. Mom? See, they add Mom, the, like, the they add, like, the studio Mom, laugh track, Mom, I don't know where you which are. covers up Mom, the real amount of Mom, cringe Mom. going on on scene. Mom? 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 Hey, Tom. Hey. How are you doing? I just lost my mom in the store. Great for you. Uh, we're not allowed any cameras in the store, so I'm going to have to ask you to leave. I just lost my mother, though. Was it these two on the PA, Some Nancy? Some crazy guy down there. Okay, I'm asking time. you to leave. What's that? I'm asking you to leave. It was a guy that looked almost exactly like me <laughs> doing it, actually. All he did was he picked this thing up. I'm asking you to leave. Okay. And he hit the page thing. I'll just tell you what he did, so. Just like that. Just like that. Ma'am, my brother's lost, and I don't know where he is. Uh, I'm looking for him. He's wearing a pair of white shorts, and he's got, like, a green hat on. And I'm not exactly sure where he is right now. I'm really worried about that. Oh, hi. Sorry, my brother's lost. He's wearing a pair of white shorts and uh, I'm gonna green. I'm going to have to ask you to leave the store. We can't have the camera. Okay, he's four years old, store. though. He's four. What we can uh, do is, if you would just please... He's probably just back by the girl's sweatpants. Not a problem. Like <laughs> Again, they, they, okay. they add the, they well, add the, add the like, the laugh tracks. <laughs> I would prefer yeah. it without yeah. them. I want to get the full, like, whiff of how uncomfortable everybody is. I can do this. That's, that's all I want to do. Yeah, making fake slash real cringe. 
Exactly, Tyler. It it is real cringe. Just real cringe that he is that he is causing purposely. Where are you from? What are you doing in town today? You doing some shopping, I guess? Yeah. So how do you know when the Uncle Chris TV says Eric Andre's better? I think. Oh no. Eric, I think Eric Andre's funnier. Just through my stand-up comedy routine. I don't know if Eric Andre makes me quite as uncomfortable as Tom Green. There's no stage around here that I'm allowed to work out at, so I just I thought it'd be good to stand on that mic there. This way, please. Oh, okay. Zemdo said hi. Please acknowledge. No. Who's Zemdo? Sorry, actually, no. This the way here. Azma, I'm acknowledging that Zemdo said hi, but I don't I don't actually know. Did I miss something? Come with me for a Well, either way. Azum, I've acknowledged that Zemdo store? said hi. Uh, actually, I don't want to stay in the store, though. That's the thing. I want to leave. Oh, there's Zemdo. So I'm allowed to leave. Oh, well, I, hey, I Zemdo. Because I'm an adult. No, because you weren't invited in the store in the first place to get on the PA system. Was that person Hello invited in the store? Hello there, Zemdo. Was that person there invited in the store? Was she invited in the store? Well, now I know who Zemdo <laughs> is. Zemdo, no, Zemdo is that guy with the orange all, name in chat. Property. Okay, well, I'm going to leave it. No, I can charge A one month subscriber well, no, of no, Tomar's yeah. stream. No, you can't. Yeah. And, no, and Twitch one. staff. Can I stay over here for a minute by the telephone? Okay, yeah, let's Real go. Real live yeah. Twitch staff is here. And their name is Zemdo. I'll just go over here. I'll just go this way. I'll just go this way. All right, that's the, that's the end of Tom Green's little run. All right. Our next one here is I'm colorblind and thought my color was red. Maybe you are red. I, I'm actually, I am colorblind. Ja my wife, Jaxi, she showed me a colorblindness test thing, like one of those like self-tests the other day. And it's like the idea is there's like, there's like nine circles and they all have like numbers written in them. And if you can identify the numbers, it means you're probably not colorblind. And I could make out maybe two, max three out of the nine numbers. Oh, it is orange, confirms Tyler. So that's not my particular particular type of color blindness. Then I could tell red from orange. Uh, but yeah, I do have I do have legitimate, like some form of color blindness. <laughs> Amy Lay insists I'm not color blind. I just can't count. No, I swear, like I could not make out numbers in any of them. I thought she was pranking me. But she was able to identify all of them. Maybe she is. Maybe she is still pranking. Me. I don't know. I gotta find out if she's pranking me now. Now you guys have me all. Did, did Jaxie? Did my own wife gaslight me into thinking I'm severely colorblind? I've always suspected that I was, though. I guess so. It would be easy to gaslight me, huh? Uh, <laughs> puzzle uh, and uh, oh, Moostrid. Moostrid. We have another new subscriber, Moostrid, everybody. Moostrid, thank you for subscribing. Thank you. Uh, Tomar, your entire life is getting gaslit. I know, Dylan. At some point, it's, I, my, I'm, I, it's, I, it's, my life's going to be the Truman Show at this rate. Uh, can we co-op game stream or something with Jaxie? Maybe sometime soon, Swaying Palm. She prefers to just lay down most of the time on the couch these days. Forcing her to, to sit upright with me here on stream feels like it'd be torture. She's got a big, heavy baby on her now. <laughs> Zemdo insists nobody's gaslighting me. Uh, Adrian, Adrian Latapier. Is that how I say that? Adrian Latapier. Thank you. We have another new subscriber, Adrian Latapier. Thank you so much. Uh, oh, we have Adrian Latapier says hello from Mexico. Hello, Adrian. Uh, 33 cats. Thank you for resubscribing for five months. Love you, Tomarites. Big wet. Or is, is Tomarites for every, is that everybody else? Or are you calling me Tomarites or something? I don't know. Anyway. Big wet kiss. Big wet kiss from 33 cats. I think that went out to all of you guys. I'm sharing the big wet kiss. Uh, with the Tomarites, as you've now been named. Uh, this one's called Gura's Feet Song. Toes and Feet. I really don't want to click this one. VTuber sings about her foot fetish for at least 20 seconds straight. Do I? I don't think I need that. I'm going to skip to the next one. Uh, dog farts like a human. It doesn't sound like cringe, but this I got to see. 
I've never I've never heard a dog fart like that ever. I think that's kind of magical, but perhaps but not not in the slightest bit cringe. More just astounding. Uh Tomar's past may still haunt him. Josh Tomar character demo one. Oh really? Is that how it's gonna be? Does anybody want to hear this is probably got my character demo from like 2007. Let's see. Hi, I'm Joshua Tomar, and I would be recording my demo reel right now if my family would keep it down. Um, Dad, maybe we should stop firing the watermelon bazooka in the house. Josh sounded really angry that time. Nonsense, son. I won't let up until your brother chooses a more viable career, like like hairdressing or shampooing. Now fire. For goodness sake, how I am supposed to sleep over this noise? It is like atomic bomb going off in here. I second that. Your behavior has frightened my kitty cat, Mr. Fuzzle Muffins. Why you guys Why gotta be, be complaining all the time? You sound like that old man across the street. No, the one with the chain years smoking ago, white. Oh my god, Harold, they're talking about I us. Was I can't with stand talent. gossip. Please do something, Harold. I'm on it, Louise. In fact, I've already dialed their number. Hello? Hello, is this- Stop calling here! I'm recording a demo! I- I mean, this has been Joshua Tomar, and thank this you for listening. This has been Joshua Tomar? Yeah. No. The cringiest part is, like, the put-on, like, natural voice. This has been Joshua Tomar? It's like, yeah, that's- that's fake. That's not really how I talked. But... Is that- that's what I'm- that's VTuber voice Tomar? Yeah, basically, Tyler. That's V- there's a reason I finally took that off my website. Like, I don't know. I I had that on my website for like a decade. That that same that same demo from 2007. Uh, but yeah, someone found my old voice one, two, three profile. I have not used that in a very long time. Uh, let's see. King Cobra JFS, the infamous hair dye video. Uh, is this a cringe video? I'll I'll give this okay, a shot. This little thing, just, just pull it right in your hand, roll it around, and just start working into your hair. This now, guy, sure this guy's doing a self-dye job. A towel, it's, it's very messy, but I'll Is he even using chances. gloves? I can't tell. It looks like he's got little, little. Yeah, he's got gloves on, but they're like There's those. A lot cheaper, a lot better for your hair than doing it. They're like those swallowing. lunch lady yeah, gloves. Well, two people don't have to get in the shower and get completely naked. I can just rinse my hair on and eat the shower head. So. Thank you, Borgnine, right for resubscribing for five hours, months. So that's not going to happen until I get off work. That's sorry, Tomar. I keep forgetting to sub because Bezos oh, doesn't yeah, want me to. <laughs> no worries, Bor B Borgnine. I appreciate it. Surely that's the Ernest Borgnine. Yeah, it's a chick product, but you know what? Fuck it. I don't care. Yeah, it's a chick product. Yeah, it's a technical foul. This guy's gonna get some. Yeah, the back of my neck is soaking as shit. Some oh, sweet lovely. blue hair. Just freaking lovely. Just freaking lovely. Yeah, I'm just making an ass of myself now. For you, YouTube entertainment, no less. God damn it. This is why you want to put a towel on before you do this shit, people. It's the back of my hair. Okay. Skip. 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 What's what's the final result at the end of this? Wait, did he is he smearing it on his face? Yeah, why are one of those funky looking dragons? Oh. I look like shit. Wow. This is highly amusing, actually. Well, I look silly, don't I? <laughs> uh. So tomorrow, I'll have to work till 5 to 1. I'll go into the courthouse tomorrow and um, pay my ticket off. So, yeah, for... So I made a couple mistakes today, but, you know, it could be worse, like I said, so... At no point did he try to wash like this. I don't know this, like, what the fuck happened this to dye King off his Cobra? skin. You don't even get to see final results. <laughs> okay, there you guys go. You get... Yeah, poor Joker baby. Exactly, Zavter. That was something. 
<laughs> I guess I guess kind of cringy. Uh, let's see. Holland's got talent. Judge Gordon makes racist jokes to Chinese contestants. Oh, it's going to be another one of these. <laughs> oh, I'm not looking forward to this. Jeez. <laughs> okay. I, I knew what I was signing up for. I don't know why I expected any different. Uh, woman confronts Waka Flocka Flame. What is this going to be? Oh my God. Waka, what's up? Oof. <laughs> Oof. Oof. <laughs> yeah. That that qualifies. Wait, Tomar, you turn it off before the guy stretched his eyes with his fingers and said me me so horny for your music. <laughs> okay. Uh <laughs> Putting my high quality Sonic 3 special stage footage to good use. Okay. This is apparently going to be another singing one. Hey, it's time to let the chaos and roll. Yeah, yeah, let's go. Time to let the blue spheres go. Time to avoid the red spheres. Yeah, time to jump on yellow spheres. Time to let the chaos and roll. If you collect the ball, you become supersonic. And if you clip all the rings, you can get a perfect score. There's blue spheres, there's red spheres, there's spheres everywhere. There's blue spheres, there's red spheres, there's yellow spheres as well. Yeah, there's red spheres, there's blue spheres, there's spheres everywhere. There's red spheres, there's blue spheres. Okay, I get it. I like the original song. He doesn't he doesn't add much, but uh his voice is just a little grating. I don't know that I'd call it I mean it's 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 like borderline cringe. It's it's there. <laughs> Show this to Corey, says not. Yeah, everyone keeps bringing up Corey. I guess But yeah, whatever. Uh let's try another one. Excellent beautiful shirt gets ruined. Okay, so this is called glow stick blows up in kids face This was submitted by someone in chat Four minutes of this though hey, no noise. It's glowing yeah. Is most of this video just gonna be a reaction? Or is this leading up to, to the, the glow stick? Well, I guess we'll find out. Man, reaction content. Reaction content. Wait, is he really microwaving it? What a fool. Don't microwave things that aren't food. You fool, you utter fool. You need to learn a lesson. You're about to learn a lesson. Oh my God. Oh! 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 Jesus, are you kidding me? God damn it, Jack. That is Come such here. a, that's such a real no reaction. God damn it, Jack. <laughs> I gotta see what to do, ding-a-ling. Oh, God. God, I told you not to mess with a choking hazard. I don't know what to do if it's in your eyes. God! Don't rub Jesus. Them. This is like, this is like that Salvia video they wouldn't let us, uh, show on, on Where's YouTube. Where's the stuff on this, Jack? God, it's so real. It's such Jack. genuine anger. Do you have another one of these two? I, I, I'm not, I'm a fly in the wall. I'm not meant, not meant, to, see, meant to see any of this. Nah, I doubt it. Don't rub your eyes. God. Yeah, no shit. I said don't microwave it. Don't screw around. What you do? Dad told you not to microwave it. He even told him not eyes. to microwave it. <laughs> If this I is, ever write Amy insists this is me researching how to be a parent. Ever write. 
Can you ever listen? Get this off. That's a pissed off dad. Okay, flush with so water for 15 minutes. Flushing away with water. I thought this was gonna be like a I'm horror, sorry, like I'm like sorry. I was gonna watch someone oh, be. Sure you're sorry now, Jack. You can always be sorry after. I hope his face is okay. I'm I really do. But that is kind of funny. <laughs> oh. I was gonna say he did decide to upload this at the end of the day. I'm sorry, I started to dial that. I didn't think it. I dialed it. No, I had a son that oh. gets the stuff in his eyes, and then I finally found the directions of what to do for it. So I'm I'm okay. No. My name's John. Oh. Just keep flushing it. <sighs> Thank you. Bye. Keep flushing. I think that's pretty much the that end of the video. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> His initial reaction. Hold on, I wanna go back. Jesus, are you kidding me? God damn it, Jack. God damn it, Jack. <laughs> you ding-a-ling. <laughs> it shouldn't be that funny. It shouldn't be that funny. Oh. <laughs> that might be a good, good video to end on. We made it to 10 o'clock. <laughs> oh. This is my favorite one of the night. I don't think we're, I don't think we're gonna top that. Uh, thank you, whoever shared that. One. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. All right, okay, all right. <laughs> this is a good place to stop. Thank you, everyone who's joined us tonight. <laughs> Uh, this hopefully won't be our last little, uh, little stroll down YouTube lane we do here on Twitch. That was, that was more fun than it should have been. All right. God damn it, Tomar, you ding -a -ling. Um, all right. Thank you. I know there's more videos in the queue. We can check them out another time. It'll be very easy to remember where we left off now. It's the one where the... Where the glow stick explodes in the guy's face. I got myself in a loop right now. It, it shouldn't be that funny. <laughs> I've not been drinking. I'm, you guys, I've been straight faced this entire stream. You've seen me. You know I haven't been drinking or doing drugs or anything. I'm just, I just found that genuinely funny. Uh, <laughs> all right. Thank you for the 100 bits, Hasa Pepperoni. I hope my throat gets better. Uh, <laughs> thank you so much. All right. Good night, everybody.